Welcome to Cod Academy's DevOps Professional Certification for AWS Learning Path. Before we get started, I wanted to give you a sense of what to expect as you prepare for the exam, as well as context for who takes the exam and why. So, why the DevOps Engineering Professional Certification for AWS? Well, the AWS DevOps Engineering Professional Certification is AWS's newest, most rare, and difficult to achieve certification. Because it tests elements present in both the Developer Associate Certification and the SysOps Administrator Certification, it covers both deep and broad subjects and materials. As a difficult and rare certification to achieve, companies looking to hire for engineers view those who hold the DevOps Engineer Certification in the highest esteem, and these engineers are especially sought after. For any intrepid AWS cloud developers looking to advance their career, Achieving the DevOps certification is a sure way to show everyone that you're a talented practitioner. So who should prepare for the exam? So in general, the exam is targeted towards practitioners with at least two years of experience in the specific skills of technical expertise in provisioning, operating, and managing distributed application systems on the AWS platform. Now, this includes people with high-level distributed systems and automation experience, it is further restricted to those who already hold at least the Developer Associate Certification and or the SysOps Administrator Associate Certification. So how should you prepare for the exam? Well, we strongly recommend that students have a firm grasp of the material in both the Developer and SysOps Associate learning paths on cloudacademy.com before learning the AWS DevOps Engineer Certification learning path. As all material in the DevOps learning path are advanced, and beginning with the assumption that you already fully understand all of the fundamentals of working with AWS and have passed at least one of the certification exams, if not both. The material focuses on building existing knowledge to improve understanding of deeper concepts when doing systems engineering and management on AWS. Beyond teaching conceptual patterns and systems thinking, the Cloud Academy AWS DevOps Engineer Professional Certification Learning Path teaches practical guidelines for how to perform DevOps jobs duties, such as deployment automation, high availability design, risk mitigation, compliance and governance engineering, and monitoring, metrics, and logging systems design and engineering. Beyond these prerequisites and the materials explicitly covered in the course, candidates who plan to take the certification exam should prepare by taking as many quiz questions on the Cloud Academy platform as they can. Yes, we really mean lots of quiz questions, I recommend that you take several thousand quiz questions. So to prepare even further, after getting a firm grasp of the fundamentals through Cloud Academy's training materials and some breadth from the quiz question practice, candidates should reflect on the AWS service documentation itself. So you should spend time skimming the AWS documentation and understanding at a high level what services exist, because on exams, AWS intentionally asks misleading questions and may invent fake services or API calls that don't actually exist in reality. So the best way to protect yourself from being tricked by fake answers is to have a mental inventory of what actually exists in the AWS service offerings. Since, of course, our courses don't specifically address the different possible fake services Amazon will make up to trick you. So what do we do after you're certified? So you take the course, you do all the quizzes, you make sure you understand the prerequisite materials, and you review the service documentation and go and pass the exam. Well, you can expect that after obtaining such a difficult certification, the possibilities for employment and work in the cloud software industry are nearly limitless. Essentially, any company wishing to heavily utilize or work on AWS is willing and excited to hire a certified DevOps engineering professional. This extreme demand for certified DevOps engineers stems from both the general shortage of good talent in the industry and hiring requirements placed on companies who wish to be accepted as AWS consulting or technical partners. So without any further delay, let's get started. Hopefully you're excited to go and get your certification and ready to start watching some courses. Thanks.